Actually, Newsies, I think, is the first movie I remember seeing in a movie theater. It truly, I think, for my generation, it was like the first time we saw guys dancing and it was like a cool thing, so it definitely had a huge impact on me as a kid. Whenever I would go out and perform like a medley or something at some benefit, you know, I'd play a song from Mermaid, I'd play a song from Little Shop, play a song from Beauty, and then I'd do something from Newsies, sort of half expecting that people wouldn't know it, and they would erupt. And i go, there's something going on here. Coming back to it has been almost like sort of jumping aboard something that already was in motion with other people adopting it and saying, you know what, let's, let's do this. Let's go back and let's turn this into a stage musical. What is this? The paper isn't out yet. Oh, I'd be delighted to deliver the headline personally. Start with this one. Cheeky boy gets nothing for his trouble. Oh. He's uh, the cocky, popular guy, but beneath all that, he's a, he's an artist because he has this sort of deep yearning inside himself. Um, just like the movie, he sort of longs to to go to another place. All across this city, there are kids who ought to be out playing or going to school. Instead, they are slaving to support themselves and their folks. Ain't no crime in being poor. And not a one of us complains that the work we do is hard. Oh yes, he's a square deal. He's definitely just this, this really lost soul trying to find a, a purpose. And he finds it with this strike. He also finds sort of love for the first time in the new female character of Catherine who, who helps bring out this hidden side of him that he's never shown anybody before because like I said he's just one of the cool guys. not in the movie. Harvey added her as um, a love interest, but um, she ends up writing the article about the strike, getting it out there about this unfairness and the need for justice for these kids. And it just so happens that we just might win, so whatever happens, let's Sort of based it off of um, Nellie Bly. She was this reporter, a journalist around the turn of the century, and uh, and she really fought for justice for herself. And it's interesting because they're fighting for justice at, this, at the same time that women are. So it's like a fight together. Even though he's kind of had like a lot of hard knocks, he's sort of the like ultimate optimist. Really, a sweet emotional center for the show, and I'm so lucky to get to play it. my druthers I would always want to do new musicals. Everything that you create is really your own and you get to really collaborate with with all your other actors and with a creative team to come up with something new and I think as an actor that's always the most rewarding experience. All the movies that weren't about Disney princesses, that's, those are the movies that I like. And being a little kid, you wouldn't normally think that you could stand up and, and speak for yourself. That's the exciting thing about being an actor, is you get to try out new lives. 